Hello everyone, this is Maria from Business Analysis Easy to Use. Today we'll explore the auto decomposing use case, the foundation for clear system requirements. What is a use case? A use case in IT is a structure methodology for elucidating system requirement and uses system interaction to achieve specific goals. It aids in defining the operational aspects of the system and how users navigate through it. What artifacts are used to describe the use case? Let's consider the main ones. Use case framework, sequence diagram, prototype CE, and mapping for API. Structure of the use case. Use case consists of the actors, description of the use case, preconditions, main flow, alternative flow, exceptional flow, restriction, error handling, post condition, frequency of use, business rules, assumption, and notes. Today we will look at the use case of the example of developing a mobile application for tracking trucks. What is the main use case that will be implemented within this mobile application? User registration and authentication, real-time tracking, reports and analytics, notification and alerts, data protection and GDPR compliance, internal API integration, external API integration, integration with the other application, technical support, and testing. In this presentation, we will look at case user registration and authentication. And so, what are the given at the start in our use case? User registration and authentication. Actors for user registration and authentication are drivers, system and security department. Description. Enable user to create account, security login, and reset passwords for accessing the track tracking mobile application. Let's take a closer look at the main flow. Driver open mobile application and select register. After press the button register, the request is sent to the system. System receives a request from driver and processes this request internally. It is as necessary to consider separately the time of the request processing inside the system. System prompts user to enter a unique username and a password. Driver submits registration detail. It's necessary to describe separately which details of the registration are to be filled in by the driver. System received information about the registration details from the driver and sent a request to security department to verify this. Security department verify registration details internally. Security department sent completed request with success to a system. System creates a user account for accessing track tracking features. System send response to driver with notification for creation account. Driver selects login on the mobile application. System receives a request from driver and provides login credential for authentication. System receives information about login credential from the driver and sends a request to security department to verify this. Security department verify login credential internally. Security department send completed request with access to a system. System send response to driver with access to the track tracking features. Driver initiate a password reset request. System received a request from driver and send a password reset link to the user email. Driver follows the link to reset the password. System received a request from the driver and updates the password accordingly for secure access. The next items in our framework are exceptional flow and a post condition. Exceptional flow. If the entered username or a password is incorrect during login, prompt user to re-enter credentials. If a password reset link expires, system generates a new link for a password resetting. Post condition. User successfully registered, logged in securely for tracking track, and can reset the password as needed. Next, we are going to talk about error restriction, error handling, frequency of use. Restriction. Username must be unique to register for the track tracking application. Password must comply with the security requirement for account creation and access. Error handling. Prompt for re-entry of login credentials if there is an invalid username or a password during login. Generate a new password reset link if the current one expires. Frequency of use. Regularly accessed for tracking track. And the last point of our presentation are business rules, assumption, and notes. Business rules. Password should adhere to complexity requirement for secure access. User data is securely stored within the mobile application. Assumption. User have access to a valid email address for a password reset functionality. Notes. Implementation of robust encryption methods for safeguarding user password within the application.
That concludes our presentation on a use case. Thank you for watching and until next time.